Hi Gemini, welcome to your love reading. How are you? In this reading, I will be looking at the current energies, the person on your mind, other details, if there's somebody new coming in, if you're looking for a new person, and other details as well. If you are new to the channel, welcome and I invite you to subscribe because I post videos every day. You can check the schedule, it is in the description box of this video. Two more shuffles. The energies around you. I think there's a desire to start something completely new. I would not be surprised if there would be communication, if there would be an attempt to apologize or to make things right. But the problem is the connection has so much friction to be restarted because of trust issues and somebody being very guarded, not uh, being that approachable or vulnerable or trusting this process. I think the best restart of this would be a friendly communication, starting it on friendly terms and not talking about feelings or romance or just gradually going to that. That is very important. Those uh, trusts need to be rebuilt. What is affecting you in your subconscious? You want something completely new. You want a new cycle. Also, this connection was karmic. And that's why you are so heavily invested into it or think about it and are affected emotionally. What was the main challenge in the past? Okay, you had this vision, idea or dream to build something joyful, harmonious, happy with this person. And with that four of wands, you might have tried to do that, you moved in together with this person, or there were ideas about doing that, relocating for some of you. But it was not that stable. It was not that solid in its foundation, in the ground. It was not a solid ground where this connection was built upon. And with that four of wands in the position of the challenge, it was not that joyful and uh, happy as well. It had those dull moments, not very colorful ones. What is something you want to focus on? You want to be with somebody that understands you, where there's real chemistry. The connection is, is genuine, is strong, where you do not need to talk with words, you can just communicate with eyes. That kind of connection, that kind of soulmate connection you are looking for word too. And you don't want to deal with confusion, insecurity, because you know that that is not a good sign if you get confused, if you don't feel secure, if you have doubts about the future of the connection. Now, some of you might want to explore other options and or fear that this person is ex exploring maybe other options and does not want to be focused at you right now. Now, what about the current energies of this person? Let's look at this person that is on your mind. What do they feel? What do they think? Or what are their overall energies right now? The Magician, Two of Swords. They want to make a decision. I think they are motivated to do something, but they hesitate a lot. Why do they hesitate a lot? Because it still feels heavy and dramatic. They don't see much mutual cooperation here. It sometimes feels like an uphill battle to work through this. It feels very heavy, it feels like a burden. So they are, they desire you, they have attraction, but the connection overall is not that uh, smooth or easy. What is in their subconscious? Uh, they want to hear from you. They want to see some success from this. So they have good intentions here. What is on their mind? They think a lot about you. What do they think a lot about? Four of Swords. Have you healed from this? Have you uh, forgiven them? What is their plan of actions? They have stopped. I don't think they have the enough courage right now to make a decision. So for the time frame that is in the title of this video, I don't see them taking action. They want to be with you. This is their dream, their wish, fulfillment, but it is just a wish without action for this person. And look at that Eight of Cups. They are just keeping the distance for now. 
Okay, how did they enter this connection in the beginning? Uh, Eight of Wands, the communication happened fast. Um, some of you might have had some distance with this person or while traveling, you met each other, but or through social media with that Eight of Wands, but it happened very fast. There was that spark, that chemistry instantly. If you want to know even more details about this person, there's an extended video in the description box below with even more details about them specifically and some details about you as well. Okay, let's continue with the other scenario. If you're looking for a new person, a new connection, let's see what is the overall energy of uh, the next new person coming in. Okay, this is a person that will insist a lot into being with you. Contrary to this person of the past, I believe that they will hit some big resistance and some big blockages from you. I don't know why, I will see it in just a minute, but they will be waiting for you to change your mind. Uh, they want to give you time to be convinced that they're love is real i do see them being highly attracted towards you i have water signs earth and fire here but in fact they see you very disinterested what are your feelings or thoughts about them in the beginning you are deeply hurt from a past story you have not healed from a past connection that's why you are not ready for a relationship you don't want to jump in a relationship. That is the moment when this person comes in. And how do they view you? How does this new person, possible new person, view you? Um, they see your interest, but they don't see you fully into that. And they doubt that you might be dealing with other people or you have options as well. And this gives this person insecurity. But I do see, as I said, a very motivated person that will be trying to wait for you they will be uh, they will get discouraged because i think they will be waiting for a long time before you finally make up your mind around this situation if you want to give this a chance let's see what is the first month possible energy of the first month of you interacting with each other the moon yes worries doubts confusion i think you will not be ready completely ready for jumping into a new connection when this person uh, comes in. This is uh, a person seems with good intentions. Yes, and I see genuine interest from this person to get to know you more. Gemini, this was the general reading. I hope this was helpful. If you like this reading, please hit the like button and share the video. If you haven't subscribed already, I invite you to subscribe because I post videos every day. You can check the schedule. It is in the description box below this video. Thank you for watching. I wish you all the best and I will see you the next reading. Bye for now.